What is this orb? Good orb. Scanner orb, not that good, whatever. Do you mind drowsy? Oh, excuse me? How dare you forewarn? Can I hit? Can I, can someone please hit this? Why do you even learn poison gas? Please die. Oh, thank you. You're still alive, actually. Go away. Finally. That drowsy was way more difficult than it should have been. Mine. No, I don't want to fight another one. Fought too many already. I drop seed any good? I don't remember. I'm going to take it anyways. Come on. Dude, I really hope we get some, uh some Joker Smash news in the Nintendo Direct whenever it does happen. I know Piranha Plant's only just come out, but like, I wanna, I wanna date when Joker will be here. Even just a month. Even if they just say like, it'll be sometime in April, I'm down. I hope it's not super far away. I would imagine they'd probably try and get like, all five character packs out in 2019. So, I feel like if they don't let Joker out in, like, April or at the absolute latest May, they're not going to be able to get all the packs out fast enough. Unless they do plan to have it go into, uh... That looks really cool. Unless they do plan to still be releasing some of the character packs all the way into 2020, which seems a little ridiculous to me. It seems like too long for character packs that are just, like, one character and then a couple of songs and, and a stage. I feel like we should be getting those every other month or so, probably. Dang it. Curse you, trap. Hey. Ba -na 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 -na. Hello. I have been looking for you, stairs. Fancy meeting you here. Whoa. I wasn't looking at the map for a second there. You wanna, like, help me out with the shadow sneak there, buddy? No? Okay, cool. I'll just do everything myself. Whatever. Thanks, Dustnor. Really appreciate it. Hey! Get out of here. Bum, ba -na 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 -na. Hello, money. Love me some money. Any amount of money is good. Go, go, go. Nope. Hey! Get dug on. Oh, now you want to help me with Shadow Sneak, when I literally don't need it. Appreciate it, man. It only had 230 damage I did. Hello. Pretty sure Temporal Tower is not as uh, big in the future as it is in uh, the past, because it's collapsed partially. So I don't know how many more floors we have to go, but it shouldn't be too many. I don't need a Cherry Berry. Watch me get paralyzed in like a floor or two and then be like, dang it, if only I had a cherry berry. Definitely you grab the money and then you leave. I'm getting really lucky stair spawns today, it seems like. Oh, well, you're slow now. Sucks to be you. Don't wake up the... Fine. You kill it then. You're the one that woke it up. You deal with your problems. What was that uh, scarf I got? Oh, Pekka scarf. Who cares? I was hoping it'd be like a power scarf or something I could put on. How many slow traps can one temporal tower have? Like, haha, ha, I get it. It's the Tower of Time. You're getting slowed. But still. I should probably pick this up. Warp Orb is meh. Better to have it than to not, though, I guess. There's no way to get out of this room without awakening this cadaver, huh? Let's go, then. Dustnor, you do the big damage. Why, of all... You have three moves available to yourself. Two of them are super effective. You go for the only one that isn't. And not only is the one you went for not super effective, it isn't, uh, it isn't even stab. What is wrong with you? Oh, not discharge. Hi. And goodbye. Oh, wait a minute. Gasly has levitate in this game, doesn't it? Dang it. Will you please shadow sneak? I, I'm paralyzed. That happened. I told you it would. Someone help me. Send help. Hi, I'm paralyzed. Just give me a second here. Okay, cool. Peace out. I hate you, Dustnor. Oh no, there's another one! I didn't even see it at first. 
It blends in with the background so well. Go away. Oh my word. Hey, QWERTY. Welcome to stream, dude. Good to see you. How you doing? No, no more Magnemites. Oh, this is the end. Perfect. If it's only 10 floors. Oh, this is only the halfway point. I love the clock noise. The ticking. Ah, it's good. We've climbed pretty far. We're almost to the pinnacle. And there, that's where Master Dialga is. Hey, Grovile. Once we've arrived at the pinnacle, do you plan on fighting right away? I don't know if it will be right away or not. The second I catch a whiff of trouble, I'm going to move in immediately to handle it. But before that, could you give me a little time to talk to Master Dialga? I want to know Master Dialga's true intentions. No way. If you talk to Dialga, then you'll probably begin to side with Dialga. Besides, the new henchmen will likely be there as well. And then it will be three on one. The chances of me winning are slim to none. Huh. I, at least. I don't plan on making friends with the new henchmen. Fine. I won't fight by your side on the pinnacle. After you fight Master Dialga, and once you are defeated, I will ask Master Dialga. Huh. Do whatever you want. I won't fight by your side on the pinnacle. You'll fight Master Dialga, and once you're defeated, I will... Okay, yeah, same thing. I am doing good, QWERTY. I'm doing pretty good. It's a good day playing some Explorers of Sky. I love this game. Probably my favorite Pokemon game of all time. We're getting close to the end of this playthrough. There isn't a whole lot more to do. After we finish this special episode, we're already about halfway through the post-game story. So, I mean, like, we probably only got two, maybe three more streams, and that'll be done. And then, I don't know if I'm going to get all of the legendary Pokemon in the game, because some of them, words, some of them are really annoying, because it's like, uh, you have to find them in a random room by a percentage chance, and then they have a low percentage chance of, uh, being recruited. Well, this just sucks. <laughs> no, not Discharge. You would get a double para. You know what? Didn't I get a warp orb? Yeah. Oh, you can't use orbs when you're paralyzed? I didn't know that. Please stop. Oh, goodbye. Hi. I need you to be dead. You've got to be kidding me. Okay, it's dead. Fine. Get Dustnor some HP back. Anyways, yeah, I don't know how many of the legendaries we're going to go about getting, but I want to get at least a few of them. A few of my favorites, at least. And then we will, uh, playthrough will come to a close. I'm thinking we've got five streams, give or take two. Definitely not take two. We've got, like, five to seven streams left. And, uh, I think I know what I'm going to play next. It's going to be a Pokemon game, because Saturday is for Pokemon. Dustnor, you want to take care of that? Thank you. Ooh, mine. Dang it. Where'd all these Magneton keep coming from? Bum, bum, goodbye. May not say much or be useful while you're playing. I'm going to be playing my Explorers of Time game. Restarted like two weeks ago. Dude, sick. Where are you at in time right now? Hello. Are you going to the seven treasure dungeons? Are those the dungeons that have, like, Giratina and Groudon in them in it? I don't remember what the seven treasure dungeons are. It's been a... I, I only 100%. I didn't even really 100%. I just did a lot of bonus stuff. I only did, like, heavy post-game stuff in this game once. Every other time I played the game, I normally play, like, to the end of the post-game's main story. And then I usually stop playing after that. Dude, I love Leaf Blade. One of the best animations in Pokemon history. Rather, it's in-game or in this one. In-game is in, like, the normal games. I'm at the part where they choose who's going on the expedition. Sick. Sick. You're a decent length in, then. You're like, you're not at the beginning of the game, but you're still, uh, probably not at halfway yet. Cass, I might have already missed the conversation, but what are your thoughts on Piranha Plant? It's pretty cool. I played a little bit of Piranha Plant. Enjoyed it a little bit. I haven't really, since Piranha Plant has come out, I haven't had a day where I can, like, uh, 
record any Smash, or even play Smash for that matter, with my boys. So I haven't been able to use it outside of, like, fighting AI. So I don't have a deep opinion on Piranha Plant so far, but I like him. He's pretty fun. I love his down B. His side B seems... Oh, I get a something in my throat. His side B seems pretty worthless a lot of the time. Oh, great. It's a monster house. Exactly what I didn't want to see. Can I kill you with a single Leaf Blade? Perfect. Hit this brawn. Thank you. Oh, no. Try and get Dustnor further in the room. All right, I really need you to not miss right now. Do I have anything that can fix this? No, I need Persum, and I don't have it. This is less than ideal. At least I'm in a position where if I press A, I'm very likely to hit something. Ow. Ow, again. All right, I'm going to hope I hit one of these things with Absorb. Yes! Any amount of HP gain is good. And the Bronzong is dead, thank goodness. Please just stop being confused so I can absorb on the clay doll. Still confused. Dang it. Okay, at least that's dead now. That's one less thing to worry about. I do have a reviver seed if this does go even more sour, but I hope that it doesn't. Alright, you know what? Aim at nothing, then absorb. Dang it. Dustor, help me. Please, I beg of you, I'm dying. I'm dying! No! Don't kill me. Don't kill me. <gasps> no! I exactly died. Oh, what a waste. Stupid confusion, man. Yeah, the ones with Giratina, Rayquaza, Kyogre. Yes, and I'm definitely going to do all seven of those because I want to recruit all of those Pokemon. I'll do all of those. Get out of here. How did Wigglytuff even get chosen as guild leader? I'm pretty sure Wigglytuff made the guild. So, like, the person who made it is the leader. Like, I don't think it was a democratic process. I think that Wigglytuff, being a great adventurer, who was well-known and well-renowned, made the guild, and then people were like, sick, I'm going to join it. Goodbye. Give me all this money. We lost a Reviver Seed, but at least we got a handful of gummies. Number one thing I hate about Monster Houses, other than the fact that they can be really annoying, is uh, the, the Monster House music, which isn't bad necessarily, but just isn't as good as a lot of the other music, plays for the rest of the floor. Yeah, I'll definitely do the seven treasure dungeons. For certain, that's gonna happen. Ice Punch. He actually did it, the madman. All right, now ghost type move. I hate you. Why do you do this to me, Dustnor? That's not super effective. Oh, that's right. This this is Gen 4. Steel still resists Dark and Ghost. That's wild. Got him. All right, we back on track. Lost a Reviver Seed, but, you know, we'll live. So many Iron Spikes. Three Poke, thank goodness. It's looking like this is going to be about ten floors, just like the first set was. That's fine. Coming for you, Dialga. To save the past. Oh no, my food items. Goodbye. Yeah, either this is the last floor or the next one is. Get that. Go away. This gonna work. You stupid idiot. Goodbye. What a dummy. Definitely give me that orange berry. Oh, dang it, I'm already full on stuff. Where's the, uh, yeah, the grimy food? Get that out of here. Who cares? Don't need it. Ba -na -na -na. Speaking of reviver seeds, after that time I made it to Alga and had no reviver seeds, I've started to stockpile them until the end. Yeah, that's probably the best way to go about it. If it weren't for the fact that I'm, uh, streaming and it would be a little tedious, normally what I do when I play the game off-camera is I will do the, uh, I'll do the footprint mini-game. Like, I'll do it, like, 30 times in a row and get, like, 30 Reviver Seeds off of it. Because if you do it perfectly, they give you a Reviver Seed every time. It's the easiest way to gather them up really fast. I don't like to 
do it too much in this playthrough, though, because I imagine it'll get a little boring seeing it's for so long. Have, like, ten right now? Not bad. Hey, we made it to the top. All right. Made it through the dungeon. What do you see over there is the pinnacle, Grovile. Got it. Let's go. Hello, is anyone home? I'd like to type with the type. I'd like to talk with the almighty temporal Pokemon, the Alga, if you have a moment. Nobody's here, huh? That's very strange. Master Dialga is always over there. Why isn't Dialga there now? Sable, I said that Dialga would send a final agent. But to send another agent back to the past, I expect it would take an enormous amount of power. To generate that kind of power, Dialga would have to hold still for some time. I thought he was in Temporal Tower. Your guess is correct. I thought so, too. I thought so. That should be right. However, if he's going to send an agent back to the past, there's another method. Back to the past. Another method? That's right. If he needs to send an agent through time, Grovile, you should know what method I'm talking about. I should know what method? No, it can't be. The passage of time? Yes, the passage of time. Rather than waiting for Master Dialga to regenerate, they will most likely look for Celebi and use the passage of time to send an agent back to the past. I'm sure of it. Master Dialga probably left here to catch Celebi. Dialga left to catch Celebi. But I don't think it will be that easy to catch Celebi. If it were just the Sableye, you'd be right. However, it is a different story if Master Dialga himself went to catch her. And that new henchman, I'm worried about their ability. Dusk Forest. I always met Celebi in Dusk Forest. All right, we're off. Hey, we're back here again. Celebi. Grovile. No matter what, she's up against the Alga. But we're most likely already too late. Shut up, Dusknor. She wouldn't be caught that easily. That's right. Celebi's not weak. But, as Dusknor said, she's up against Primal Dialga. And the resourceful new henchman, too. The last time I fought Dusknor in Deep Dust Forest, we weren't too far from here. I think Celebi would be on the lookout and would have left there by now. Celebi. Celebi! I'm begging you. Keep yourself safe. I wonder if they'll remake Gen 4. I mean, they got to at some point. It's Gen 4's turn, man. It's next on the list. Gen 3 got their remakes. One and one got two remakes, which is ridiculous. It should have only gotten one. And Gen 2 got its remake. It's time for Gen 4. There are two Rhyperior on my screen. Look at these units. They are so absolute. Absolutely dead. Almost 500 experience, my word. Don't mind if I friggin' do. Fork it over. That is a ton of EXP. That's level grinding experience right there, my dudes. Hello, stairs. Salamence! Don't you dare. Ow. Goodbye. No, no sandstorms. What is setting up sandstorm? Is there a friggin' Hippowdon in here somewhere? Oh, I'm glad that trap failed. Oh, you know what? I meant to store items because I'm so full on items, but I didn't because I'm dumb. Well, too little too late. There is a Hippowdon. Wow, what are the odds? Why is there a Hippowdon in this forest? That gave more than the Rhyperior? Wild. There are two of you. Get out of here. No more hip out on. Stop. I don't like it. Oh, thank goodness the stairs. Get me out of here. Okay, good. We at least get a little while with no sandstorm. Is there anyone in chat who's watched Steins Gate, the anime? I want to know if I'm the only one who, like, 
doesn't like it. Easy knockout. I don't need that apple. Or am I, like, the odd one out? I know it definitely has a following. I got a few friends who say it's pretty good. Yeah, I know Armdor's opinion. He likes it. Surely there's someone else besides me that doesn't like Stein's game. Tin Poke. What a great amount of money. Steins Gate is kind of meh for me. That's fair. I did not mean to take your place, Dustnor. I don't want you to ice punch this thing. Don't cringe. And you know what? Fine. You want something done? Oh, dang it. Now I'm cringing. I'm glad I wasn't there to take that ember. Get out of here. Can you please just use the super effective move? Don't you die. Don't you dare cost me a reviver seed. I don't even know if I have any. Go for 600. Except no! There's another one. Where do they keep coming from? Okay, it's dead. I don't need that. Probably should have just used it, but whatever. I honestly don't like Steins Gate either. Okay, as long as I'm not the only one. I still haven't finished it. I finished episode 10. I was supposed to watch, like, two more episodes before stream, but I just ended up talking about Nintendo Direct stuff on my Discord instead. Oh no, Tail Whip from a Rhyperior. Honestly, that should do damage. Have you seen this thing's, like, wrecking ball of a tail? But, uh, I'm gonna give it, like, three, maybe four more episodes, and then if I'm still just not enjoying it at all, I'm probably gonna quit. Although it is only 25 episodes long, I've already watched almost half of the series. I might finish it just to say that I did. But it feels like such a chore to watch it. Because I just, like, I don't care about the characters. The plot, it, like, the whole time travel thing is kind of interesting, but, like, I just don't care. They don't do anything super interesting with the time travel stuff. And some of the stuff they do with it is really stupid. I don't know. We'll see. Is this it, Grovile? The place you met Celebi? I have a lot of gummies, but sadly I'm playing Explorers of Time, so spend as capitalism doesn't exist. Truly a dark timeline where there is no capitalism. One thing I do like in Mystery Dungeon is that you can, in Super Mystery Dungeon, is that you can push the partners rather than just swap with them. Makes escort missions easier. That does sound pretty useful, yeah. Yeah, that's right. It's quiet. Was she already captured? Was she already taken away? Or maybe she sensed danger and ran away from here. It's possible she outwitted them. Maybe she's still hiding somewhere nearby. Could be any one of those. There's something strange about the air here. Celebi. She probably left already. Wehehe! <laughs> oh no! I knew it! They brought me right into their trap! Huh, Dustnor, Dialga's new henchman, is just as crafty and wicked as you are. I am Master Dialga's only henchman. I can't allow anyone to take my place. Here they come. <laughs> Here we go again, boys. Goodbye. Stop it, your boy. Easy one hit. Nice and one tap. Ooh, good job, Dustnor. Down to just four. Now, Dustnor, you're weak to, like, literally all of their stabs. Attack me, not Dustnor. No, stop attacking Dustnor! Leave him alone. Get out of here. I'm really upset that that didn't kill you immediately. Well, at least Dustnor followed up. Yes, attack me. Attack me and only me. No, Dustnor! Oh, I didn't have a reviver seed? I thought I had a reviver seed. I guess I didn't. Well, way to ruin everything, Dustnor. Oh, goodbye. Wehehe. <laughs> Not here. Did they run away? Look! Look for them! Wehehe. <laughs> that was close. However, if the Sable I set a trap over there, I know. Celebi isn't there anymore. But you're still going, aren't you? On from here. Yeah. 
knock out the Sableye, or get some information out of them, to find Celebi and Dialga. Well, this is a little annoying. Why do I have so many apples? I lost all of those gummies. My goodness. Even after dying, I still just have so much garbage. Alright. Give me, like, a reviver seed. I have a couple stored up, don't I? Oh, yeah. I've got, like, a page and a half of them. Give me, like, two. That should be enough. That ought to do it. I hate Hippowdon in this game. And also Obama Snow. They are very annoying. Oh, hello. Fancy meeting you two. Don't you dare focus your energy at me. Who do you think you are? Thank you for the shadow sneak. Goodbye. Oh, you're alive. Oh, Sandstorm gives you the spidef buff. Right. Hey! About time you got up to level 46, Dusnor. Hippowdon! How does Dusnor have more HP than Grovile? Isn't Dusnor's HP stat, like, actual living garbage? I mean, I don't know how good Grovile's is, but still. Oh, hi. Can you please ice punch the dragon flying types? I beg of you. Thank you. Hey, now I'm level 47. Suck it, Dustnor. What move? Detect. Who cares? Who needs detect when I can have more attacks? Look at that HP recovery. Love it. Go away. You're still alive. Alright, good hit, good hit. Totter seed, whatever. Ah! Why on earth would you ice punch? Thank you. Let's continue on. How many floors was this place again? Like eight? Something around there. Curse you, Sandstorm! I gotta, like, readjust the way I'm sitting. I'm feeling a crick in my back. Well, it definitely wasn't worth getting you slowed as well, but whatever. It worked out. Go this way. Hey, good choice, mate. We out. Ba -na -na -na. <laughs> Goodbye, Claydol. Hardly knew ye. Another Rhyperior. They are just everywhere. Not so tough without your sandstorm, are you? Ah, oh, dang it. I shouldn't have said anything. Highly doubt I need... Is that a Rossberry? I don't think I'll be needing that. What is this? The Insomniscope. Who cares? Wait a minute. Up here. Thank you, stairs. Get me out. That was good use of my time right there. What are you? Power band. Absolutely give that to Grow Vile. more power I got, the better. Curse you, Hippowdon. Stop spawning. Who do you think you is? There's a ditto? Hey, get out of here. Oh, that was the ditto. Goodbye.